Hey everybody. So I just got done working a whole string of nights. Uh, kept me from uh, going out metal, metal detecting. Uh, kept me from putting any videos up. Uh, but I'm off today. And um, I'm going out to a park. I've known about this park for quite a while. Um, but I didn't really know that much about it. Uh, I found out from uh, someone I know who has had many years dealing with uh, the public parks around here that this park at one time was part of a uh, military air force base right beside it. Um, so I kind of perked up when, uh, when they told me about that. Uh, this base was established in 1942 and um, it was uh, decommissioned from the military in I think the mid 60s uh, but it's still an active uh, air base it's just more uh, public um, I'm hoping I find some uh, some military items artifacts out here uh, that would be nice um, but we'll see what happens so here we go I was uh, walking around this park and it looks like the, the whole thing is sitting on top of field dirt. Um, these woods here behind me, uh, if you look, the whole thing is on a slope to the woods. I'm hoping you can see that. It's going downhill there, all the way around. So, um, I'm gonna find a good place to get into the woods that uh, is really congested in there and uh, uh, hopefully I can do some swinging in there so uh, we'll see what happens well I found a trail it's a pretty wide open trail it's got a lot of open space around it uh, one thing I'm finding is uh, it's pretty trashy through here so uh, it's really going to test my uh, my skill uh, Look at that, there's, there's like stuff everywhere. And, uh, yeah, right in through there. See that cushion? There's a cushion there, and there's a cushion there, and there's just lots of bottles and, and trash. And over here, is a PVC pipe. So I know there are pipes running through here. Uh, I don't know if there are any uh, cast iron pipes or, or anything like that, but uh, hopefully if there are, they're too deep to uh, be picked up on my, my detector. So, But we're going to give this a shot. Well, I just found a surface find. Neat little golf ball. Uh, this area does have traffic back here where I am. In fact, I just had a guy walk through and uh, uh, he just kind of gave me a creepy feeling. Alright guys, I uh, thought I'd better beat it. Guy went by me, uh, went up a little ways, started hiding, hiding behind a tree like um, maybe I couldn't see him and he's on the cell phone talking to somebody watching me. I think uh, instead of sticking around to find out what happens next, I'd probably be better off not sticking around at all. Wow, guys. What do I tell you? I'm glad I got out of there when I did. Um, I just got done showing you guys that PVC pipe sticking out of the ground. And uh, a guy was walking down the sidewalk then. And uh, he stopped. And uh, he looked at the camera in my hand. He looked like at the bag I have that's got other cameras in. And, um, he looked at my metal detector and uh, he said, uh, you're finding gold, aren't you? So I'm looking for whatever I can find. He went on, but he only went about 40 feet down the trail and he ducked behind a big tree. And I guess he didn't think I saw him. But he's kind of looking out around that tree at me and uh, he got on a cell phone. So the guy's uh, hiding, looking at me on a cell phone. <laughs> uh, I figured it might be a good idea to get out of there. Got up to the car, I put my stuff in, and I got in. 
no sooner did I do that, but uh, a little car pulled up at a pretty uh, high rate of speed in the parking lot, parked, and a couple guys jumped out and ran towards the woods. Yeah. So, uh, you know, I'm glad I got out of there. Um, you know, I might have had a viral uh, uh, video on my hands if I didn't, but uh, still, I'm glad I got out of there. So, I don't think I would be going back there unless I had uh, company with me, got a guy or two to go out there with me. Um, I uh, normally, uh, if I go into the woods, I normally carry a handgun, but I have a uh, hunter's license to be able to do that, and it has to be concealed, or not concealed, but it has to be uh, uh, in the open so it can be seen. Uh, I don't have a CWP, so I can't carry one concealed. Uh, might want to think about that. Um, I'd rather have it be seen just the same because, you know, somebody uh, had the mind to try to do something to you. I'd rather them see I had a gun and then, you know, then not because, you know, they might have a second thought about trying to do something. This video is not done. I'm, uh, I'm going to find someplace else to go. I'm just not exactly sure where. Um, but uh, we'll figure it out. This is a monument for Camp Severe that apparently was located around here. Uh, there's nothing left of it. In fact, the only thing around here are trucking companies, industry, and some rundown homes. Uh, so I got to do a little research to see what I can find out about it uh, because so far this monument is all I know. Uh, I just thought this was interesting. Well, I'm back out here at this old school location again. Uh, this is uh, last time I was out here. I did a video. It was uh, an embarrassing video. I found nothing. Uh, problem is, I know there's stuff here. So um, the grass is getting a little tall in places, uh, and I'm going to have road noise. You can hear it now. But um, I'm going to give it a shot. I'm going to pull something out of here, good or bad. I'll pull it out. So let's get at it. Well, this is the first dig I set the camera up for. Uh, this is the first thing that sounded good, really. I've dug a lot of tin foil here. I had one that thought sounded good, but it turned out to be a chunk of aluminum. <laughs> Another piece of aluminum. Alright guys, this one is a tight signal and it's ringing up in the 80s. I'm going to guess it's a coin. I haven't been shooting much of anything here because uh, I've been having to sort out all the trash. But this one I feel like I have to. Here. Oh, that cool. It's a dog tag. I can't make anything out on it yet. Give me a second here. All right, guys. This is interesting. I have no idea what this is, except it's not a dog tag. Uh, it's got lips all around it. Uh, up through here is Hebrew. Down here, I don't know if that's Chinese, Japanese, I can't tell the difference. This, this right in here looks Greek. 
but I can't make anything uh, I can actually uh, understand. Some kind of brass or copper tag. But I think it's a piece of jewelry. That is really cool. I like that. So I'm trying something new. I'm uh I got the uh AT Pro on uh Pro Zero. I don't know if you can pick up on that. Probably not. But I have it on Pro Zero. I never used that setting before. But I'm hearing all those grunts. I can hear everything coming through them too, so I don't know if this is going to be helpful to me. Like, you hear that coming through that grunt? I don't know if I would have heard that ordinarily or not, so I'm just playing this out like this and we'll see what happens. So I'm digging that signal. There's something that sounds like iron in here, but something that sounds better. It's interesting. I, I don't know what it is. I think that's my my out my iron sound, but it looks like a mechanism. It looks like a it used to uh, like a lock or something. I'll take that home, clean it up, see if it is anything. It's kind of cool. But it probably. probably has some brass or something in there too. It's probably my high signal and the rest of this is the low signal. All those little pins. Cool. Alright. Right there is where my hole was. I pulled up that uh, mechanism or lock or whatever it was. And uh, just right here next to I got a signal. It turns out to be a coin and my plug, let's see, oh there it is, it has a penny. And uh, it's a memorial. And my eyes are so bad I can't get a date off of that, so uh, give me a second and see what I can get. So it looks like it's in 1975 or 76, maybe a D. I'll have to get a loop on it when I get home. I didn't bring it with me, but but if that's the case, that would be a copper penny. So I'm doing a lot better today than I did last time I came out here. All right, on we go. All right, this is another one of those targets that just says, "Shoot me, shoot me." You got to shoot a live video of me. Just sounded really good. Oh, I see it. I see it. It's a coin, I believe, and I believe it's a penny. Uh, right here. It is a Perineus Memorial. And, uh, boy, the front's just got crust on it. So I don't know if I'll be able to see that. Alright. Good deal. Alright. I may have myself a little uh, coin spill right here. 
is the plug I just dug to get that penny right where my shovel is right in there is another signal it sounds just like it and it's just as deep so let's see what we get That's exactly what it is. And it's another penny. It's right, right there. Well, what is that? That might be a dime. That might be the back. I'll have to get it cleaned up and I'll let you guys know what it is. I think that might be a dime. Obviously it's not silver. Alright. Good deal. Alright everybody, I think I got another coin here. This ground seems awful uh, rocky at least it did there on one spot. I can't tell what it is. I'm going to have to let dry out and see what I can find out about it. And I'm pretty sure that's a penny. I see a head. I don't know a date or anything. Like I guess I have to let dry out. And I'm kind of dried out myself. I, uh, I'm out of water. And uh, so I'm kind of heading back to the car. And, get some more water. It's kind of hot out here. So I'm going to swing on the way and hopefully I can find some more stuff before it's time to go. So, uh, here we go. Man, I'm hot. But, uh, I had fun today. I really did. I mean, in spite of the way it started out this morning, uh, not knowing if I was going to get mugged, <laughs> you know? But um, I had fun. I mean, when I started finding things, you know, it, it, it started to turn around for me. I didn't find that much, but um, I did find that charm or that pendant or whatever that was. Um, I like to get that home and maybe get some uh, lettering off that, maybe even a date. Uh, maybe find out what that is. Um, then that, uh, I think it's an inside of the lock. I, I'd like to get that uh, cleaned up and find out if it has some copper or brass or something in there. Something that gave me that high tone because uh, uh, it had a double tone on it. Uh, and maybe even figure out what it, what it is. But, um, you know, and one, one of those pennies might be a weedy, but I, I, it's just so crusty. Just let it dry out and maybe uh, get flaked off and figure out what it is. Uh, but all in all, um, I had fun. It was a good day. I uh, uh, don't get to come out too often, but uh, it's been over a month since uh, I was out last time. But, uh, you know, I'll be back out. And until then, catch you later.